It was just a case to protect. You had to. You were there, you were there to protect the, the aircraft carriers because the planes was what was needed to beat the enemy out there in the war. It wasn't destroyers shooting torpedoes. It wasn't battleships. Well, the battleships uh, and the cruisers and the destroyers. When you got to a certain island, uh, you did the bombardments. Uh, you, the first one I went to was Tinian, and uh, for two days. Uh, the battleship just blasted that island, and it was nothing more than a damn piece of sand as all the whole place was. We just about blew the whole thing out of the, out of the world. Uh, all the trees were all gone and everything by the time we were done with them. So you were able to witness the pre-bombardment for the invasions? Oh yeah, we were part of it. Uh, the battleships didn't have to get in close, and then the cruisers were inside of them. And then the destroyers, being the smallest ship, we were the closest to the beaches all the time. And uh, but it really wasn't a, that much of a danger because uh, the Japs were there on the island and uh, nothing but a bunch of palm trees and everything to protect them. So it wasn't much danger of us getting shot back at that time. Of course, we had major battles later on uh, out in the South Pacific. But in the beginning, that job we had was a pretty good job. Just sit there and blow the hell out of the island. By the time we got done, there was hardly a palm tree left on them. And so many times uh, you lost an awful lot of Marines, and that was always Marines at that time, in the beginning. Soldiers came out later on uh, as we got closer to Japan, but uh, in the beginning it was Marines, and a lot of them just got mowed down. No matter how much bombardment we did, never did figure out where them Japs were hiding. <laughs> Because there'd be hardly a tree left on the islands in the beginning, and some of those islands were really small. Tinian and Saipan was my first two engagements.